how to uh, the Singapore Lake. So data is the new oil. Data is the asset. Let's live, breathe with data and transform the world. Super interesting to see how some of these larger enterprises are leveraging data and AI in their companies and also meeting other leaders, I guess, in their respective companies in whether it be fintech or other industries that are related to us and what they're doing and how they're adopting Databricks was uh, super insightful for me. The hottest new programming language is English. The data and AI world tour in Singapore is very insightful and I think it will benefit my company as well. In the space of data, it's not just about technology, but more important how you define the right data governance and as well as the architecture foundation. To me, I mean generative AI or AI in general is here to stay. The event was great and it's good to hear about the latest features of the Data Lake House and some of the features that can actually enable generative AI and LLMs within the, the, the platform. So it's, it's really exciting to learn about the new features. The level of energy in this room right now is phenomenal. Uh, coming just uh, freshly from Bay Area, this level of sophistication and focus on data architecture for AI tooling is really exciting to me as an enterprise software founder. I had the opportunity to talk, lot of, uh, talk to a lot of experts uh, that I met in the event and uh, discuss uh, how they're using uh, Databricks for their deep learning applications and I learned a lot. This is an event that brings you know, the, the business and the technology together. That's awesome. The Databricks uh, Data and AI World Tour in Singapore has been amazing and uh, we will bring back home uh, many new ideas uh, with all those new innovations.